Hi everyone, Rick Bray with BT BOCES Instructional Support, and in this video I'd like to show you how to load Google Docs or any file from Google Drive from within Schoology. Now this is assuming that you have already connected your Google Drive to Schoology. So the way we do that is just like before by adding materials. Now you can connect a file from Google Drive and link it to either an assignment, uh, to a discussion, or to a page, and the workflow is always the same. Or you can simply just put that file directly on your materials page. But again, the, the workflow is always the same. So we'll just pretend that we're going to put this file right on our page. To do so, I'll click Add Materials and Import from Resources. Because again, remember, your Google Drive application exists in Resources. On the left-hand side, we have Personal Group and Apps, and Apps is where Google Drive is within Schoology. Click on Google Drive, and all you have to do now is select the file that you'd like to import. Now, to get the file in, there's a few different ways you can do it, uh, really two, but they both get the job done the same way. Uh, I can either check the gear, uh, excuse me, click the gear to the right of the file I want to load, and I can either say import file, which makes a copy that the students cannot work from. They'd have to download that copy and work on it on their own, that's fine. Or you can import a link, which will look the same, but it provides a link to, in this case, the Google document where students can, can view it and access it. It's, it's similar, but they're a little bit different. Um, so that's one way is to click the gear and access that. You can also check the box and select import. Uh, you would do this if you wanted to add more than one file is the idea. So in this case, I'll import the link and it loads up. And once it's there, you'll see at the bottom of the page is uh, untitled document. Now, I know it says .dox, uh, .docx, which is a Word document file. Don't worry about that because it has this link. And you'll see when I click on it, it opens a new tab, which takes me to the Google document itself. And that's going to mirror whatever sharing permissions you have in Google Drive. So if this file is view only access, your students can only view it. If it's comment, they'll be able to comment and so on and so forth with edit. So that's one way to add a file from Google Drive into Schoology. Now, like I said, you can also attach it to maybe a homework assignment. So in this case, if I add an assignment, and if I name it, uh, we'll call it homework, and maybe I'll put a description in there. Down here is where you would normally load a file. I can select add a resource, and again, select my apps on the left, Google Drive, and select the file that I want to add. Maybe we'll put this one in instead, and we'll import it as a file this time. Okay, and when we create the homework, again, you'll see at the bottom the homework is there, and when students click on it, they'll have this link that they can view, but you'll notice this time, because I imported it as a file, it's downloading it. It's not opening uh, a, a new tab to allow me to work on it. So in this case, uh, Importing the file would be if you wanted students to have their own individual copy of it, whereas maybe importing a link is where you could work collaboratively on a document. So there's a lot of ins and outs of this. As always, please feel free to uh, email Taylor or myself with any questions, but that is how you load a file from Google Drive within Schoology. Uh, thank you for watching.